Hello Chinomaniacs, I'm Gabriel from Burning Angel and currently I'm in our greenhouse. Yesterday we had some heavy rain so I can't go to the fields due to my weight. Yep, a little bit tummy. And uh, so, uh, back in the greenhouse the peppers are growing nicely. Uh, but uh, we found some new invaders. Uh, so from the la since the last uh, harvest uh, we are checking Tommy mostly, he's checking the plants and we find some new invader like the cotton ballworm. So you might know it. This is how look and attack this is how it looks when he attacks uh, the pots. It's making holes into that, eating out the inside and uh, shitting in it. So it, and ruining it. So we fortunately captured them on time, uh, give them some uh, uh, some sprays, some chemicals, uh, Mospilan, which is seven days due, so it was ten days, approximately ten days ago. We are almost ready to for the new harvest. Uh, fortunately, they looking good, nice. So I'm, let me show you the, as you can see, scorpions. Mostly, but the reapers are really, really nicely uh, ripening. Check it there. Okay, see, also we have our nice tails uh, here also. And I'm showing you uh, the second part. So, uh, fortunately, the reaper somehow has wake up and they are ripening as crazy ones. Uh, check it here, you can see also a lot of, yes. lot of reapers. So, we are really happy. We will have some something to harvest here, and it's they are hell hot. Also, uh, our colored uh, scorpion peppers are growing nicely. The red one somehow finished. Yeah, yeah. we have the main harvest. So check it. So the size of these scorpion morugas is, I think, amazing. And uh, inside it's look good. Uh, we are already closing the doors, uh, even during the day, late afternoons. So you can see already closed uh, to keep the worm inside and uh, this way we I'm probably it's 27 to 30 degrees inside and during the nights in the most coldest it was I think 14 degrees here uh, this is helping us to for about the to keeping the temperature and so the plants can uh, grow nicely uh, what I do yeah outside it's not looking that good uh, but not that bad. So, as I mentioned here, these scorpion peppers are finishing, but outside they're, they're still in their almost best form. Uh, so we going to harvest there much more than uh, inside, if I'm comparing the separate one. But also the habaneros are uh, growing like crazy. Uh, and, and the other part there, these the, 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 the cayenne peppers and also the jalapenos are starting to ripening again. So we will have a lot to harvest, a lot to process and if somebody is uh, curious or just want to eat some free hot peppers, uh, they are welcome. Uh, one condition, you have to help us with the harvest. The processing, we don't want to kill you, so you don't have to, it's enough just uh, about the harvesting. harvesting, you know. When you're processing, you have to cut it, uh, wash it, cut it out, and all the capsaicins uh, can uh, hit you in the face, and you, you might be a crying baby. Also, uh, what I want, yeah, second door closed. Oh, basically, that's that's it for tonight. Tonight, today, uh, you can see. The, yeah, so the oh oh, I have a hello. <laughs> uh, the sun is going down. That's why this this uh, beautiful. Uh, picture about me, so nice, 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 nice. So what's this? So the li nice lightning, I'm looking almost good. And also I'm still keeping this uh, uh, leaking form, uh, still growing my beard. Even some of the people tell me that I should shave. No, I look really bad without shaving. Okay, so uh, that's about me, that's about the peppers. And uh, next week, I really hope that I can be here again. Uh, we have a little bit busy work with all the uh, harvest processing 
and also next weekend we will be in uh, Budapest in uh, uh, in the Omic uh, not festival but uh, mm, feast not feast um, agricultural uh, something okay I forgot the word so uh, next week we will be in Budapest uh, for several days uh, if you are somehow there you can check us and say hello. Okay, so thank you, thank you, Chilmaniacs, and goodbye.